Good afternoon, good morning, good evening, good whatever time of day it may be for you, ladies and gentlemen. I am the Layback Gamer, and we're back with some more Sly 2 Band of Thieves. In today's episode, we are going to do the missions. Well, start all the missions. Not going to finish them all in this episode. Okay, here's the plan. First, take some recon photos around the area. Then make your way up to the re-education tower. Looks... Pleasant enough. Oh, and stay clear of tanks. You know, so you don't get blown up into little sticky pieces. Sorry about that. I'm just opening up a, uh, a bottle. So yeah, this is the first time we actually uh, have some uh, free roam around the area. There's a boat that's supposed to be passing by there. Let's wait for it to get out to the open. The Contessa has these boats out on patrol against Nayla's army. They could be useful to hitch a ride. Not really. Unless it takes me to the spot of another clue. Alright, now we need one of Neela's HQ. Neela's made a headquarters out of that old bank. It's a pretty secure location. It'll take some doing to drive her out. But Bentley's always got the plan. <laughs> oh, I'm about to be shot at by tanks. Okay, so I gotta go over there and get a picture of the Contessa's getaway blimp. I wonder if I can get it as it passes by here. That's the blip the Contessa used to escape from the prison. Maybe we could use it to our advantage around all these high towers. Yes, they are very annoying to climb up to. We gotta get one of the tanks and then into the re-education tower we go. I think, where could I have missed one? The Contessa's all geared up for war. Just our luck. Okay, Sly. Head off to the re-education tower. I suspect that's where we'll find the clockwork eyes. You'd be right, Bentley. You would be right. my ears out so I can try to listen for the, uh, the last clue bottle. Right now all I can hear is my dog going nuts. The door is locked from the inside. Try working your way around to the tower's window. Yep, Bentley, we're going. Don't worry. I've already been up here. Did I hear? No, I don't. Uh, why are you, you clue bottle? Stop hiding and show yourself. Or at least make yourself be heard. Bentley, there's more than just the clockwork eyes up here. Why are you doing this? Neela! She set me up. I'm an honest cop. Of course you are. I've read your psychological profile. I know that you're honest. Then why are you doing this to me? Because, dear, you're honest. You see, by chasing after Sly Cooper, you learned too much about the Claw Gang and its spice operation. It was only a matter of time before you figured out that I was a secret member. So, when Neela gave me a chance to put you in custody, I took it. Coward! You're a disgrace to Interpol! I'll make it my life's work to destroy you! Oh, I'm afraid your life, let alone your life's work, isn't going to last much longer. Once I integrate the Clockwork Eyes into this device, 
Your life's work will be whatever I tell you. I won't be brainwashed that easily. Quite right. It won't be easy. Or painless. But I will reprogram your mind, and you will take the fall for me at Interpol. Now, just lay back and relax. Go to your happy place. And stay there forever. I don't think they've seen you. Take a few photos and get out of there. No. I've got to help Carmelita. She's in trouble here. There's nothing you can do now. Get the recon photos and come back to the safe house. I swear, we'll find a way to help her. Okay, so this is interesting. Now let's get a picture of this terminal. That old terminal should be hardwired to the systems in this tower. We need to find a way to get it online. Yep. Interesting. Inspector Fox is restrained in an old Iron Tech 250. Crude, but effective. Very. There's the clockwork eyes. The clockwork eyes! They seem to be routed through that control board. Get a shot of the console so I can decipher its make. There's a shadow guard. Those are the Contessa's elite shadow guard. Tough is too sissy a word to describe those guys. And the mind shuffler. That's... That's a mind shuffler. I didn't think they were real. It's made of equal parts science and black magic. Indestructible to conventional weapons. Alright, head back to the safe house and we'll get a plan together. Oh, this is going to be a long chapter. Of just climbing around the place, trying to find that last bottle. The war between Neela and the Contessa has put the castle on high alert. To get at the clockwork eyes, we'll need to subtly manipulate this conflict to our advantage. Here's the plan. Murray, sneak into the castle and kidnap the head of security. I want to ask him a few questions. Meanwhile, Sly and I are going to get a little paranormal. I'll slip into the crypts beneath the castle and put together a bad mojo bomb. It should be enough to destroy the Mind Shuffler. Slot, you capture a few local ghosts and drop them into Neela's headquarters. Hopefully the near-death experience will inspire her to purchase more mercenary firepower. We've all got our assignments. Good luck. Yep. So I should be able to finish these uh first... well... Maybe two, possibly all three of them. We're going to start off with the big man, the Murray. I believe, actually, I'm going the wrong way. Alright, so what would my stuff for him? That's the uh, Atlas Strength, Juggernaut, a Raging Inferno Flop. Let's map that to uh, R2. Thanks for the little bump, I was about to get hit. Uh, where's Murray's thing? Oh, yep, that even the bat at the tide. There's Murray's, oh, Murray's thing's in the back of the castle. Up there. Eh, lovely. So I think it's... Nope, wrong one. There we go. Okay, I knew we'd get up here eventually. I don't think I'm that good. Of 
course, I underestimate them. Hey, bad bat. No hitting the Murray. You don't do that. Hey, Murray, can you see the general from there? Nope. Just an old man coming up the ramp. Don't let his appearance fool you. That's General Clawfoot. And he's one of the toughest old soldiers you'll ever see. Not to mention head of castle security. What if he doesn't want to come? I don't want to hurt him. Oh, don't worry about that. He's only afraid of two things. Fire and water. Other than that, you couldn't hurt him if you wanted to. He might even come in handy along the way. As a projectile. Wow. That is handy. Hmm? Great! Now bring it back to the safe house. I marked it in your Banaku car. Oh good, I can run. Was that Atlas Strength? You can jump while carrying someone. Oops. Uh, and a curve pop. Let's hope that I didn't kill the good general. Where'd he go? Uh, general? Where'd you go? Did you get managed to get all the way back on top of your roof? He gets hide. I gotta go find him again. Uh, that's gonna be annoying. You go. It's not him. you go? Come on, show yourself. Can I restart this? Yeah, we're just gonna do that, yeah. Let's just do that. Save on the time of trying to find him. Let's not, let's try not to get hit this time. Drop him. Again, I'll try to skip the uh, briefing again, or the second briefing. Hey, Murray, can you see the general from there? Nope. I can't. Just an old man coming up the ramp. Don't let his appearance fool you. That's General Clawfoot, and he's one of the toughest old soldiers you'll ever see. Not to mention head of castle security. What if he doesn't want to come? I don't want to hurt him. Oh, don't worry about that. He's only afraid of two things. Fire and water. 
Other than that, you couldn't hurt him if you wanted to. He might even come in handy along the way, as a projectile. Wow, that is handy. All right, let's try this again. Take two. Great. Now bring it back to the safe house. I marked it in your binocular. All right. No problem. Just take the long way around. No. No hitting me. Don't hit me. Oh, watch that. Watch out. Watch out! Ow. Oh, I think I just tossed him in the water. And I just killed him. Whoops. Great! Now bring it back to the safe house. I marked it in your Banakuka. Why'd you have to make a sound? There we go. Okay, we got. Uh oh. No tank! No shooting me! Just walk behind this tank. He won't suspect a thing. As a matter of fact, you can say I'm pushing him. There we go. Well, well, General Clawfoot. We've got a lot to talk about. You wouldn't by chance know the security codes to the castle gates, hmm? Don't feel like talking, huh? How about a little of this? <laughs> Drac! <laughs> Talk, you scoundrel! <laughs> that was Bentley tickling him with a feather. Bravo, Bentley. You are a genius. Congratulations. It should be celebrated by all... No, I'm just... No, actually, you can. It can be if you want. Alright. Let's pull off the slide drop next, since that one's going to be fairly... Eh, that one's actually going to probably be difficult. Well, not difficult, just very time-consuming. Surprisingly, that guy did not see me. Around here somewhere? I keep thinking I hear it, but... And I end up not hearing it anymore. It's a re-education tower, so... Uh, Alright, Sly. There's your new objective. Sneak inside and smash the coffin of the evil wolf priestess. Sounds pretty harsh. Does the old girl really deserve that sort of treatment? Weren't you listening? She was an evil wolf priestess. Once you smash the coffin, it'll free all the ghosts trapped in there with her. Okay, I don't know where you're going with all of this, but freeing trapped ghosts sounds vaguely heroic. Yep, let's do it. Allow me to free them. We're not gonna. The vaults in, I think, coming up in the next set of missions, so after we beat the Bentley one.
come down and further we go. I think Bentley is going to need to come down at some point. Alright, now we've done that. Oh, not quite. Try breaking open that coffin in the middle of a room. It looks kind of, you know, evil. Yes, I know. I was busy taking care of the other guys. Nice work. Now head outside, and I'll fill you in on phase two. Oh, hooray, I love phase two. Woohoo. Oh, this is gonna be fun. I've modified the imager in your binocucom to capture ghosts. Didn't I just set these guys free? Why would I want to capture them again? Not to worry. It's only a short-term confinement. Gather all the ghosts, then set them free down the chimney of Neela's headquarters. I get you. She'll think it's a sneak attack from the Contessa. Correct. If I did my math right, and I always do my math right, Neela should respond to the assault by purchasing more firepower. Anything bad for the Contessa is good for us. And we get to really freak out Neela. <laughs> oh, Sly. There we go. There's one. Got nine more of these guys to go. And they're hidden all throughout the castle. Okay, heard it. There we go. Got another one. Ghosts are phasing in and out of the buildings. Gotcha. All right, let's head to the peaks of Prague. Oh, uh, I guess not. There's one all the way up there. Let's go grab it. I could get off the rooftop. Uh. Oh, 
I do not like this place at all. Why'd you have to go duck behind something? Silly ghost. Sly, where'd your hat go? There it is. Decided, hey, you know what? I'm gonna also uh, defy existence. Can't get uh can't get too much close up close and personal than that. There's another one in the city below. and one down there. Sure to phase back into existence. Not quite. Be making a round around here somewhere. Gotcha. The other two are over there. I think you got some loot on me on you that I would like to take. And I hear that bottle. I don't. It's kind of annoying. You have all the ghosts. Now just make your way to Neela's HQ and drop them down her chimney. That's why we said this one for last. So the Contessa wants war, eh? 
Perhaps it's time I purchase a little air power. A few bombers should put that old charlatan in her place. <laughs> Yes, play right into our hands. Right into our hands, Neela. You guys can't hit me. You're way too slow. Could there possibly be one down here? I would have heard this. If it was down here, I'd hear it, right? Yeah, I would have heard this. Oh, where could you be? Where could you be? Why aren't you anywhere that I can find? Very easy. Okay, so Extractor, I think, is from... Yup. Yeah. Let's do this instead of the Shrink. Take a long time to find. That's it. I knew she'd have a bad mojo collector to transport the overflow. Huh? It's a semi magical device that sucks up bad mojo. I'll need it to gather the runoff from these spouts. Wow, sounds easy. Not really. Bad mojo is a powerfully dark force. Take any damage while carrying that collector and you're done for. Wow, sounds hard. Yes, it presents an interesting tactical challenge. Perhaps I could use the death traps native to these crypts against any foe that might attempt to thwart my collection of the ectoplasm. Huh? No, no way that'll work. I'd use that switch to smash up the guards before they ever got near me. Precisely. Once all four cylinders of the collection device are full, that should be enough black magic to destroy the mind shuffler. Oh, I love this game. It's humor. That is cake! Wanna come after me, you freaks? Oh. Whips! I thought he. I didn't think he was gonna hit me. Oh no, 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 no. Okay, fine, I don't have to listen to that again, good. Bam! Bam! Well, bam! This is the easiest one. Right, come on, almost done. Almost done the first of four. There we go. Looks like the spouts run out of bad mojo. No matter, I'm one fourth of the way to a full tank. Yeah, we don't want to take any damage. I think we restart from square one if we do. I'm not really sure how to use your computer, but a new crypt 
should be up in your binoculum. Crips over on that side of town. So try not to accidentally drop off the ledge. Right, there we go, just over there. Oof, that was a close one. Oh, whoops. I didn't mean to do that. Alright, I guess we get it. Nice. Of that, uh, yeah, we, we need to be able to use a cane. Oh, why? Why are both of them coming that way? It is fun to watch Bentley, uh, essentially run and... Oh god, yep, I knew that was gonna happen. Do I have to start all the way from square one? It's gonna be a long, long little section if I do. No, okay, good. Very quiet. This is it. Yep. In we go. Oh, there's a ramp to our left. Oh, that would have been nice to have known at the time. Oh, well. This is gonna take me a little bit. At least get to start inside the crypt. Oh, supposed to grab that. Hang that! It's not ready yet! Oh, whoops. Tried to jump, couldn't do it. Couldn't make it out of the way in time. This'll hurt. It's not ready yet. Alright, now we got him. Careful not to accidentally miss on that one. Come on. Almost done, right? Oh, I missed. 
Poor timing there. This one's still out! There we go. this up <gasps> ah, no I was there no no I was right there all I had to do was just kill that guy I was right there. It should hurt. Now we got a rhythm. Oh, this is much better. This is much better than the first couple of times. A little bit more and then we're done. Well, with this section of this. Collector is full. Moving on to the third crypt. This was this is gonna be a long video. I'm seeing it at 40 minutes. I thought it said 20 or a while ago. That's why I decided to continue onward. There should be a new waypoint in your binocular. Huh? Uh-oh. That was a close one. There's his waypoints over there. Alrighty. Should be safe to quickly drop down. And just jump my way around here. That's over there, nice. The guard. I am a guard. I am one with the guard. I am one with the guard. I am one with the guard. Wait, oh, yeah, I could just put him to sleep. Uh oh. All right, we're good. I thought I was gonna miss miss the timing there. Here. 
Ah, that's what that one is. Boom over here. Now lure him over this way. Eat that. Ooh, a five and one. Nice. That'll hurt. I like my. Uh, oh, that was a close one. I like my guys extra crispy. Come and get me. Come and get me. Come and get your free turtle here. Oh, too late. Offers up. You instead get a free crush. Oh, oh for a second I thought I got hit. That does it for this room. Looks like I've only got one more crypt to go. That one wasn't too bad. Ooh, yeah, we're going on for lit. I do apologize. I thought I I kind of mistimed this this episode. I really gave you the hang of this. I just sent you another waypoint, but it's kind of buried in the well. Yeah, you'll figure it out. Oh, that's what that is. I thought that was a place we had to go for the first fly. Uh oh. No, 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 no. Okay, fine. That's okay. Go the other way. Go the other way. No, not that. Not this way. I don't remember I could do this. sleep down here instead. Even though he's right in front of me. Oh, thank gosh. Oh. I see. Just like Murray's getting the hang of uh, the computer, I'm getting the hang of the grips. This 
one's definitely a more uh, interesting trap layer. <gasps> I fell into the wall. Oh, I accidentally hit the. Oh, I knocked my own L1. Or L2. Oops. My bad. Watch out! Okay, that was a close one there. And we got her. Good job. Deed is done. With a mojo collector at full capacity, I should be able to blow the clockwork eyes off that mind shuffler. This is going to be great. Yeah. But the build up to that was a little uh woo, cut and tent. A little tense there. Give me the rundown. Right, fellas, let's get down to business. The first steps to escalating the war between Neela and the Contessa have gone well. We are down to the final setups before we spring our trap. Sly, I need you to steal a voice modulator from the castle and install it under Neela's headquarters. If all goes as planned, it should allow us to give orders to her mercenaries without being detected. Unfortunately, Neela's recent bomber purchase has made her army over-enthusiastic, and they might strike before we're ready. Which leads me to Murray. I need you to hotwire one of the Contessa's tanks and go to town on the mercenaries. We just need to intimidate them a little. And finally, I'll venture back into the crypts to power up that old computer in the re-education tower. We're going to need it to save Carmelita. Oh, and Sly, if you haven't already got one, you'll need to buy a paraglider for the heist. Okay, let's move out! I don't even think you can. it'll start the cutscene for the heist until you get the paraglider. Or at least it, it will. However, then when if you do go onwards, it'll say uh, it won't let you actually join the mission until you get a paraglider. So... That's going to be all for this episode. Sorry it took so sorry it was a bit longer than most of my other ones. Uh, but thank you everybody wa for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed. Hit that subscribe button if you really enjoyed. Don't forget to share this video or any of my other videos to anybody who you think will enjoy my content. I'm going to try and find the last clue bottle. And when I do, that's when I'll uh, start up the next episode, and we'll be playing as Sly. So we'll get the other three missions done really quickly, and then go for the uh, for the heist. So until then, oh, excuse me, take it easy.